Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And, um, you know, we've been two years, more than two years on Windows 11. We're about to, we're almost at three years and we're getting to 24H2 soon. And one of the first things, of course, that is of interest when you uh, look at this is that after all of those years, it's obvious that um, we can't say that that much has changed on Windows 11. They have added new features. They have, you know, done things that not necessarily everybody wants, like, you know, getting a co-pilot app and stuff like that. But definitely at 24H2, although we will have some new features, it's still going to be pretty much Windows 11 like we've been using it for the last three years. Nothing really amazing. Nothing that is mind-boggling that's going to change our world. Uh, you know, Copilot is kind of more of a joke than anything else right now. Um, I don't know. Uh, we know that this is going to be released, you know, this fall, but... Um, I guess this is, as we move on, pretty much what Windows 11 will be like and will continue to be like. And um, as we move near, um, you know, the uh, end of Windows 10 and, of course, the annoying pop-ups that Microsoft will put on a lot of PCs with Windows 10, what's going to happen next is probably going to be uh, simply, um, you know, the rise of Windows 11 simply because people are changing their computers. Um, some will be upgrading and forcing, you know, their Windows 11 finally on their machines that are supported. Um, but with no news of Windows 12 and uh, no news of anything new out of this and Microsoft focusing way, way too much on AI, um, we're just going to be floating away on Windows 11 with the same, you know, we saw that there's a few changes. There's one with the apps here with the icons and stuff like that. But, I mean, it's not necessarily what people have asked for. And it's not going to be a major change either. Um, you know, even the apps, which will eventually have categories uh, that you can choose from. So, I don't know. Um, my question on this video for all of you is um, either what would you like to see changed in Windows 11 or what uh, you know it, what do you think this is going to happen this is going to do is it going to change by much or are we going to pretty much stay on what is Windows 11 the looks of Windows 11 and, and stay pretty much the way it is for now if you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.